We are back, Brex 75, here in the beautiful Antoniola Golf Course. Of course, it's inspired by my friend Rick Schultz, which always does this Brex 75 thing. And I'd say it's probably the best match I can do against myself here in this course. And look how fast these greens are. Oh, get in. Par 71. I just feel super cool talking with this beautiful castle in the back. My best personal record ever, it's a 68 and it's on this golf course. That's why I feel very confident playing here. Greens are super tough, but as well, the ball goes where you send it. And I hope I can show you guys some good playing today, some good golf shots. Hope you guys love this beautiful no sweater. I mean, you guys know what it is. You guys know what we do, super classy stuff. It's all golf. So this is the outfit. Let's see how the game looks today. It's always good when the first driver goes kind of well. I think I've chosen the worst day to come here because with the wind, it's crazy difficult. No, I should know never to underestimate the golf course or judge a day by the practice. It's usually the opposite. When you have a great practice round, you're probably gonna play bad. When you have a bad practice round, you're probably gonna play very good. I do make the clothes, but I do not make the covers for the putters and I lost mine. So if anyone out there makes good covers, I'll probably need one. was on the hill. Let's go. It's too good to be true. Something boy. Come on, turn. Ah, that was a shitty swing. All right, this is the beautiful second hole. It's a part four. It's exactly 300 meters, so it's not too long. There's this beautiful castle view in the back. Very bad spot for my ball to be in. I'm in the rough, there's a lot of wind. Let's see if I can get it on the green. Ah. This wind it comes and goes super hard. This was pretty much on the line. I was aiming right, to be honest. Because I thought it was the best spot to miss, even though there's the little valley here. Oh, as I said before, it's a tough golf course. And especially with the wind today, I didn't think it was going to be this windy, honestly. I saw the sun and I thought it was going to be just a regular easy day. Let's see, now we're gonna go in the holes that we show that I showed you in the first video. The par three, number three, four, and five. Very tough holes. Right. All right, uh, another par. I'm pretty happy, honestly, because scr scrambling wise today is pretty good. Okay, this is a tough hole. I don't know if you guys remember from the last video who has seen it. This is a tough hole. It's a par four. There's the castle there. Feel the wind, feel the wind. A lot of wind to the right. Thankfully, it doesn't pull to the lake. I just picked a yellow ball. But let's see how it goes. That is 
Last week I played uh, with uh, Renato Paratore, the DP World Tour player, and he told me, dude, you should clean your driver. He said, it's too dirty. The ball doesn't fly from this. Shoot. When I'm on this spot, I just feel I have to give a shout out to this beautiful golf course. Almost the same spot of last time. is perfect. Because that was a minute from a disaster. Because I think the ball did hit right here. Look at this. One centimeter less and we would have been all the way down there at 30, 40, 30, 40 meters. Come on, come on. All right, first green, first birdie. That was actually the first gain I got in four holes. Let's not relax now. I don't need to go back into my comfort zone, which is even par, plus one, plus two. I need to play on the par. That's what I want to do, as I did when there was the Antoniola Open, which I won, minus three, 80, 68. That was the best round of my life, and it didn't even feel like it was hard. Today with these wind conditions, way harder. Look at this course. I mean, come on. Look at this view. It's a 300 and something. And I'm aiming. That is a... 61 meters. That's it. That's Let's not complain. Picture yourself here playing this hole. <laughs> Did I do better? 100%. Am I happy about it anyway? 100%. Because now the tough ones are coming and I was able to get around this part of minus one, so I'm pretty happy. That didn't look that good, but trust me, it is if you consider that there's this big depression here, if you don't stay on the right, you will end up down there. So this to me is a pretty good shot because I'm Place you didn't have to go. Go to the right, long square. Seventh hole, 308, not a long par four. Not the best place where I wanted to leave myself.
Did I really do that? Huh? Why did I do that? It wasn't easy though. There, so did you get it? Was it close? Oh yes it was. Oh yes. That was that was a very good save. I am very happy this is not an easy hole even though it's super short. Uh especially because I I ate it fat think in my head honestly I'm saving shots for the next hole which is hole number eight all right this is the hole that's the first fairway way where you have to land the ball then there's this huge gap which is a uh, water then there's the fairway up there and the green is actually up there on the hill so it's super hard so first shot it's an hybrid uh, right there for 200 meters I knew it! I never hit the ball right. If I miss it, I miss it. I hook it left. Play the third one. Play the third shot. All right, you see? This is the hard hole. That's where my ball is. My second one. I'm just gonna check real fast if I see it. But just to show you guys what's the hole. That's where the tee shot where was. And this is the huge hard part, which I don't know how high I handicappers. Oh, okay, so no, my goal is definitely gone. <laughs> so, sometimes people go down here, find the ball. The flag, it's that little thing up there and it's 220. And we are down here. So, it's not the smartest play, but we're gonna go for it. Oh well, it's almost like I played in three shots. Hope we find it in a good light. We take the Bushnell, that is the green, and we ended up down here. Look how hard it is. This I mean, I love this course. This is gonna be a part four very soon. They're changing it. That place where we hit the second shot from, is gonna be the new green. And this is gonna be, I don't know, I think nothing. Let's see. Let's see if we can somehow see the ball. Yes! Okay, one ended double bogey pad. Double bogey, eight hole. We're still on track for the 75. Let's get it, come on. Oh gosh, I'm out of breath. No, I'm gonna go with the nine iron. It's really hard on the green and it's not gonna roll, so.
pitched and died. Have you ever been to Castle Stewart of the, the Gulf Links? I've been last month with my wife and it's the best. Come on! All right, we need to write the four, the six, no, sorry, the seven, the double bogey, the seven and the three for a plus one, 37 on the first nine. Let's go on the second. This is all number 10, 378 par four. Very tricky because this is the direction of the fairway. And that's the green down there. You could hit the ball on this line, but you need to be like at least 270 to get into the fairway. Oh! <laughs> the ball went there on the rough. It flew the next fairway. I think I'm right there. All right, this is the ball. So let's see from here to the green, 46. All right, and from the green, 33, so 45, 70, 6, 78. Probably gonna either 58 degree maximum, which is usually 85. It's gonna play around this distance. I'm pretty good. Yeah. Oh, get the three, be lucky. Ah, oh, get down. <laughs> He's probably lost. Ah, oh, come on, what a stupid shot. What happened here? What happened, Marianino? What happened? That was a disaster. I could have hit the tree. Ah, oh, I think he's gone. Shoot, let's see where it is. I hope I can find it. Oh, come on. Why did I hit that? All right, so I went through that tree pretty fast. So it should be down here somewhere. Okay, so I maybe can find it. Oh, yes, right here. All right, could have been worse, could have been worse. Could have been very much worse. Let's see. Go. Go. Get down. I'll take that. Went way high. I didn't expect that at all, I'm honest. I really hoped for it, but I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. Oh gosh, what a par, what a par, what a par. No, was it a par? One, two, three, four, what a par. Right, this is gonna end well. I can feel it. I'm not swinging very well right now, I don't know why, but that felt very flat. We flew this 230 bunker. We flew it by a lot. Let's go. Oh, go. Go. So high. Probably too much. That is probably too much. Come on. Yeah. Alright, let's show everybody how good Marianino. How good MDV is with the little, with his hands. Uh oh, this is not a good sign. I can't see the ball. Oopa! Oh, shoot. All right, this is gonna be funny. This, this was pretty pretty hard, so I'm not gonna take it too too hard on me. Let's see if this one can be a little bit better. Get down, get down, get down. Ah. 
I got this, I got this. Ah, <laughs> oh, that was a mess. Double bogey, but we still have. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. All right, that's a good drive. That is 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 a huge drive. 195 to the flag. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's how it is. That's how it is. <sighs> well, at least I was confident, and at least they hit a tree and it came back. So it was going back. That was gonna be pretty fun. I think I hit a tree up here. They came back somewhere, look. All right. Well, not even that short, but still, uh, you could tell that uh, I'm kind of losing the concentration here. Why did it bounce left like that? That was a very weird bounce left. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm losing the concentration. I'm kind of tired. Uh, I really wish I could make a bird. Hole, but, uh, the next one is pretty hard. It's a very long part three, and we're sitting at plus three, I think. So 71, 72, 73, and we want to break 75. So we only have two bonus shots. One eighty-three flag in the middle. Come on. Let's see what it is. Okay, right here. Alright. No. Come on. <laughs> it's getting dark, I need to run. It's it's becoming run golf. Oh, right there, behind. I saw it. I think I hit the tree again. Oh, but that's, that's okay. Very oh, far. Yes. Yeah. Come on, don't like it. It went pretty, pretty strong. Ah, uh, let's see. I'm not in the mood. I feel I'm not in the zone, like I'm not. You know, mentally there. That's the mood. Always have these two with me. Sandwich and butter. Oh, that was a bad choice. It was too much. Let's see what we managed to do here. Yeah, that was the best I could do. Stop, stop, please, please, stop, please, please. Look where, where that's going. I wouldn't give me a two pot from there, honestly. How fast you can go from playing super good to super bad. Let's see. What am I gonna do here? That is what it is. That is not bad. Get down. Right, there's a couple of holes I like right now, so let's see if we can make a bird.
It was very hard. <laughs> it was very hard and we have the wind in the back, so we might see something cool here. Camera. And I was like, is that my ball? Did I flew everything? I was pretty sure. But it was not. But this is good enough. Let's see. everything up that was such a good drive uh, I don't know don't know what to say guys I'm trying to get back into to the zone I kind of feel I want to laugh because this is the hardest roll definitely the one I don't like even though I never really made mess here but let's see if we can get a bonus even a par here would be definitely definitely a good result That was probably the best drive of the day, which is a good sign. Probably the best drive of the day. You cannot imagine how hard it is to find the fairway on this hole. I don't say this to brag about myself, but this is definitely the best tee shot I've ever hit in my life in this hole. Let's see. Left is short. Go, 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 go. It's okay. It's okay. Let's go. Let's go. I like it. Let's go. Let's go. I'm happy. Handicap one, harder soul. That's okay. I've done way worse today. <laughs> so this is good. Part this is special, part three, downhill, but like very much, very downhill. Yes, yes. Yes! <laughs> Come on. We got a good looking bird. The confident. Come on, Potter, please help me out here just once. Look, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Uphill, probably left to right. What is it? I think we got this. We got this. We can do it. Look, with the castle in the back. Come on. We can do it. Come on. Ah. Then we got 18. And we're good. Come on. Let's see. Come on. Come on. See! 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 I didn't even look at it. I was like, no, the sound is not coming. Yes, let's go. Let's freaking go. I don't even know how much I am. I think I am at 74 right now. Let's get it. I mean, I feel I'm, I think I'm projected for, see, let's go. I think I'm projected for 74. Oh gosh, that was such a good part. I didn't look at it. I was like, oh, the sound is not coming. I'm not gonna eat an iron here. It's my favorite hole. Let's go. All right, this is the best view. The best view. The best. Yes! Straight down the freaking middle. Let's go! I'm running like I'm a 13 year old. They just found love. <laughs> Come on, isn't this the best view ever? Especially when you hit a driver right down the middle and you birdie the 17th hole. Guys, this is a monstrous drive. I think I got so much adrenaline in me that I even, didn't even realize I hit it so hard. 103. 103 from the ball. I got so much adrenaline that I'm gonna hit a 95 shot. 
because otherwise I'm gonna be long and I don't wanna I don't wanna approach, I wanna pot. Even though if it's uphill, I really don't mind. heart is, is beating like did you guys see it it's right there right there right there close to the pole we're potting guys we're potting that was going a little bit to the left i was like oh no there's the water oh shoot i'm sweating and it's super cold all right it's perfect look at this i'm gonna leave you guys here and enjoy this pot because I'm never gonna approach from there. Never. Not even if. Not even if. Guys, I don't believe it. I don't know where the other camera died, but it died right. I mean, when I came back, it was off, so I don't really know when it died. But look what I did. I left myself with this pot, which is not that hard, but it's not even a gimme. So. I really hope. I think I broke 75, I don't, even, I don't even remember, I think I shot a 74. It's 18 holes and it's getting dark now, so I kind of like, I don't know, I feel exhausted. But that was amazing. Oh well, it looks like I didn't break 75. <laughs> I was counting the score right now. And it definitely doesn't look like it. Let's let's go through it together. But the phone died. I just checked the other phone. You guys didn't see the first part. Ah, uh, that was so unlucky. But the whole thing was very lucky. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna go on right now on the computer and we're gonna check together what the result was. So we were not able to break 75, but we played with a 76 on the first video. Not my best playing for sure. Yeah. Uh, what to say? It was fun. It was a lot of fun. It was hard because there was the wind and it started getting dark. I really thought I played 75 or I broke 75. But I know, I'm pretty positive, I can break 75 at Antoniola very soon. I actually did those like couple of double bogeys without even realizing, so. Well, let's see if next time we can do better. See you guys at the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a comment. Tell me what to do next. Tell me what course you want to see and where you want me to go play. See you in the next one. Ciao.